Hey, I figured out a way to play Joe Buck standard tuning capo on the first fret. I'll play a bit and then I'll explain it. So it's a B9 middle finger 2nd fret, 5th string, index finger 1st fret, 4th string, ring finger 2nd fret, 3rd string, pinky 2nd fret, 2nd string, your thumbs meeting the 6th string, and your pinky or palm meets the 1st string. And then you lift off your index, and you let the 1st string ring out optionally, you'll hear him occasionally do that. Otherwise, you can leave it muted. And then you go on to A major 7. So, middle finger, 2nd fret, 4th string, index finger, 1st fret, 3rd string, and ring finger, 2nd fret, 2nd string. And you can let all the strings ring out except for the 6th string. So you can let your thumb mute that or just not play it. Should I grab the fifth? And then you go into F sharp minor seven. Except you want to grab it like ring finger on the fourth fret, fifth string, and then your index finger bars the second fret, fourth, third, and second string. And then you kind of want this like six string rattling. So it's kind of like... Got the E bass. So I'm kind of using my index finger to kind of like half mute it. part of the song so D major 7 which is you're just barring or fretting 2nd fret 1st 2nd and 3rd string and you're playing 4th through 1st strings and this is a D flat or a C sharp minor 7 so you can bar the 4th fret up to the 5th string, and then you've got your ring finger on the 6th fret, 4th string, and your middle finger on the 5th fret, 2nd string. Back to the A major 7. And then that F sharp minor 7 with an E root, so slash E. That is all.